Please welcome your next act, gentlemen that uh, really, really had fun with. Please welcome Andreas. Looking at me, you may not know this, but one of the things I like to do in my spare time is make short films. Okay. And I have sent my films all over the world. And I have gotten rejection notices from all over the world. <laughs> However, this one time, a film festival actually showed my film. It was a film festival in Hamburg. I figured, great, someone in Pennsylvania has finally recognized my genius. <laughs> but wouldn't you know it, I find out that it's a completely different Hamburg. This Hamburg happens to be in Germany, a foreign country. <laughs> well, anyways, I make the best of a bad situation, and I book my flight to Hamburg, Germany. <laughs> I land in Hamburg expecting to get the VIP treatment, expecting a limo to whisk me off to the film festival. But there's no one there to greet me. So I actually phone the festival to find out what is los. <laughs> As it turns out, they tell me that they're much too busy to send somebody to come pick me up. I figure, man, this must be a huge operation. They, they can't spare one person to come get me. So they give me directions on how to get to the festival. By subway. <laughs> well, I figure it's a film festival. They must know what they're doing, right? So I take their advice. I take the subway down there. I don't know a word of German. <laughs> Everyone on the subway is speaking German to each other. And during this whole trip, I keep saying to myself, please nobody talk to me, please nobody talk to me, please nobody talk to me. <laughs> Some eight hours later, <laughs> I get to the movie theater. Or should I say basement? My film is showing that evening. I am one of 20 films. There are 20 people in the audience. <laughs> <laughs> and after each film is shown, the filmmaker gets to come up on stage and do a Q&A. My film is the last one in the evening. <laughs> So good. And then they asked me to come up to do the Q&A. Good thing about it is that it finished right before it even started. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this experience has put me off of eating hamburgers altogether. <laughs> That's my time. Thank you.